my very first video on this channel. Today I will be doing a little intro of what to expect on here and also explaining where we are about to go. This is going to be all things travel, all things John and I, all things me, fashion, just things that I love. It's just going to be me. So if you're here from Instagram, TikTok, wherever, thank you for joining and follow along this journey. Okay, so if you have came here from Instagram, you already know this, but John and I are moving to Germany. So I will insert little clips from that video right here. We're moving to Germany! Yay! <laughs> For at least 15 months, we will be in Germany. So John's sister's there and her husband's there, Mary and Spencer. Shout out to giving us this opportunity and inviting us to your guys' adventures. And so we are gonna be working in a um, resort slash lodge and doing anything from bartending to working in a gift shop to ski rentals, anything you can think of that would be in a resort. So that's what we're gonna be doing. Ditching our jobs, selling all of our stuff and we're getting on that plane. So we're really excited. Um, so yeah, thanks for tuning in. Bye -bye. Bye -bye. So that video explained a bit of things, but I'm going to go in a little more depth for this video of how we got to where we are and how we decided to move to Germany. So one day I was at work, just, you know, working, and John texted me a screenshot and he said, let's go. And the screenshot was this. So when John was down, I was like, I've got to take this and run because I never thought John would honestly be wanting to do something like this. I always wanted to travel, I wanted to do foreign exchange programs and all that stuff when I was younger, but it just didn't happen. And so we're older and wiser and have no responsibilities. We were like, let's go. So we did have one big responsibility and that is we literally just bought a house like five months ago. And so we were like, well, shoot. But we did say that we wanted a rental one day and we just didn't think it would be this fast. And we we just really didn't think this was coming. So once we decided to go, it was honestly so fast after that. So the first step was we had to send in our resumes. And then once we sent in our resumes and we kind of just waited for like a week, week and a half. And then we got set up with an interview. And the interview, they were supposed to be separate, but then the uh, the lady who interviewed us, she's like, well, I know you guys live together. Do you guys just want to do the interview together? We were like, yes. But we just did the interview together and it was basically just explaining what Idolvice is and how this process works, which we already kind of knew how it worked because Mary and Spencer went there or left to go there in November. So we were kind of there along with them while they were figuring all this out. So it wasn't much of an interview, it was kind of more like an orientation almost. And so then she gave us the green light that we were going. And then after that, then we got a bunch of emails with loads of information and things that we needed to fill out. So we needed to do a background check. We needed to get fingerprints done and sent in. We needed to get a physical and then we'll also need a COVID test before we leave, I think. We started doing those ASAP. We had to turn them all in within a certain period of time. And then once the background check was, um, should have been finishing up, then we got sent our departure date. So that departure date is May 9th, which from now, the day that I'm filming this video, it is a week and two days away, which is just crazy. So then once we got our departure date, we're like, okay, this is happening. This is real. It still doesn't really feel real and we literally leave in a week, but it's going to be real. <laughs> While we were waiting for like the background check and stuff, we decided to sell a lot of our house thing stuff. Luckily, we had only been in the house for about five months. And so we didn't have much in the house to begin with, which honestly was really nice. The moving process was super smooth. And so we sold our, like a couch. We sold uh, kitchen stuff that we didn't use. We had a bike that we didn't use, a coffee table, a desk. So clothes, just stuff that we knew when we came back, we wouldn't care about. Because, um, so then we sold everything and we knew we had to find renters. So we posted, a, once we got the interview and we got the, once we got the interview, then we decided to post on Instagram, on Facebook Marketplace and 
our Facebook feed and we were kind of getting nervous because we'd get have some people come, some people not. We really wanted someone that we like trust and we just felt really good and wanted we wanted them to have the house. Because we were really worried. I mean, it's our, kind of like our little baby, so we wanted someone that would take care of it and want to take care of it and love it like we do. And so the people we found are awesome and we're super excited for them. And they move in tonight and this weekend. So their uh, lease starts May 1st. So that was super nice to get that over with. And so we'll be living with John's parents and my parents who live like a minute away from each other. So we'll be living with them, which is where we also stored all of our stuff, which is really nice to be able to do that and not have to get a storage unit as well. So over the last like month or so, we've been packing and taking loads. Anytime we were in Meridian, we would take a load in the car. So it was the moving process was really smooth. I don't think, I told John today, I don't know if that'll be the case next time we move because we'll probably have more stuff and not as, I don't know, not maybe not as much time. So it was really smooth. We have everything in John's closet. Okay, we're at John's parents. This is like the fourth trip over the last couple weeks. And hopefully we just have one more tomorrow and then tonight is our last night. So we'll probably have one more too when we come here to sleep. I think we are officially moved into John's parents. We have, I think just like one more box of little random things that we use every day. So we weren't able to pack up quite yet, but I cannot believe that all of our stuff in our house fits in this closet. Crazy. I mean, we officially are out of the house. Guys, the house is empty and we are about to drive away and we are ready as we'll ever be, as John just said. It's super weird seeing our house empty as we just moved in not too long ago. Our mirror used to be right here. So, peace out 8863 and the renters are coming in tonight, which is super sad. So this week, it's just gonna be a lot of goodbyes. This week will be bittersweet for sure. I still, still doesn't feel real. I don't know if it'll feel real until we like land there or we're on the plane for 10 hours. Once we get there, then we'll um, have to quarantine for two weeks. We're gonna be trying to make videos that whole time as well. I don't know how we're gonna do that, but we're gonna document that. That'll be really interesting. It will be in the room that we are staying in while we are there, which is super nice. So that is how we got to where we are. And so now I'm gonna kind of explain Idlevice. So it's a military like resort basically. So it's for American military families to come and vacation that are like deployed anywhere in the world or live anywhere, they can vacation here. So they hire a bunch of Americans to work there. So that's how, so we're going under a civilian contract, which, um, so that's the 15 months, that's why there's that kind of that weird timeline, but it's a 15 month contract. They pay for us to get there and to get back. And then they also um, provide the stay for us. So we will be staying, there's three employee wings on the, in the resort. We get our own room, John and I get, um, get to room together, obviously. And then there's like a common kitchen and common living space. There's three in each. So we actually get Mary and Spencer's old room because they're going into an apartment. So that's super exciting for them. So we can be doing anything from like, anything you can think of in a resort and lodge that would be needed. That's what we'll be doing. So I'll be food and beverage and John will be working in the warehouse and we get a minimum of 20 hours of work a week and then we also get time to go and do stuff so we can explore we're very excited um like i said it doesn't feel real but that is kind of a recap of how we got here what we'll be doing so we'll be documenting here as well as we'll be posting all of our instagram tiktoks all of that fun stuff so follow us on all of the socials and let's subscribe and like and view and do all the things thank you guys for watching and we will see you in the next video